When Grandma's dog Mossy comes round to our house, we play ball. Good girl. Now, catch. Yay! Well done, Mossy. Tim, smoothies. I'll be back in a minute. Wash hands, please, Tim. Oh, OK. <laughs> a little bit of ice for madame. <laughs> <laughs> I love your smoothies, Dad. OK. Ready, <gasps> steady, smoothies! <laughs> oh, the blender is really, really <laughs> noisy. Mossy! <laughs> and it makes Mossy bark. <laughs> I think Mossy's barking at something outside. Oh, Tim, look! Up in the tree! Oh, yes! It looks like Tiger Fluffy Boots, which is Higgly Piggly's cat. Ah! Do you think she's stuck? Yes, um... Dad! What is it? Look, it's Miss Higgly Piggly's cat. We think he's stuck in that tree. That's why Mossy was barking. Oh, yes. We need to go and see if we can help Tiger get down. But will one of you stay with Mossy, please? Oh, I will. I will. Oh, poor old Tiger. Oh, really high up. Yeah, he's a good climber. Hello, Tiger. Oh. Dad! Topsy! Is he alright? Yes! I don't think Tiger Fluffy Boots is stuck, Tim. He's happy. Cats love climbing trees. Yeah! There's no need to worry. Tiger will come down when he's ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Tiger Fluffy Boots. He doesn't like Mossy's barking. Hmm. Let's go indoors and help him with Mossy. Tiger Fluffy Boots will come down on his own when the barking stops. OK, Dad. OK. We take Mossy into the kitchen and she has a drink from her bowl. Mossy stops barking and we have our smoothies. Smoothies. Mm. He's really nice, Dad. Thanks. Mm. Oh, Mossy! <laughs> Yes, I know, Mossy. Mrs Higgly Piggly's cat is still up in the tree. Dad! What's going on? Look! <laughs> Tiger Fluffy Boots is even higher up there now. I don't think he can get down. I think he's really quite stuck now. Can you get him down, please, Dad? Oh, yeah. You can climb the tree and rescue him, Dad. Yes. OK. I'll borrow Mr Fenn's ladder. Oh, yay! Brilliant, Dad! Please, will you both stay inside and play with mushy, noisy pants so she stops frightening Tiger the cat with her barking? Oh, yeah, yeah. yes. Um, she likes playing with cuddly toys, so... Hey, Mossy, you can play with Fluffness today. All right. Here we go. Hey, you should do it. Okay. We'll soon have the cat down. We give Mossy her old teddy fluff nest to keep. And she forgets all about Tiger the Cat. Okay. Brilliant. Come on, Puss. Come on. Come on, come on. Tiger. Come on. Come on. Hello, Josie. Hi, Marie. Hi. What's going on, Mr Odell? Mrs Higgly Piggly's cat stuck up this tree. 
There, look. Oh, dear, no, he's gone too high up the tree. Sorry, Topsy and Tim, I can't reach Tiger. When Dad called Animal Rescue, they said it wasn't safe for them to climb up so high when a cat gets stuck. They said it was a job for the fire brigade. Wow! Even though we're worried about Tiger Fluffy Boo, we can't help getting excited when a fire engine comes down our road and pulls up on our drive. <laughs> One of the firemen is Carson, who is our friend Kerry's dad. He'll rescue Tiger. Oh, I can see the problem. All right, lads, let's get the ladder off the truck. Careful, boys, careful. There you go. Keep going. That's it, yeah. Ladder's pitch. Grandma arrives just when Carson is up the ladder rescuing Tiger. Up there, Mrs. Higgly Piggly's cat. Yeah. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> Here he is. Ah. Oh. I'll take him. No. <laughs> oh. Oh, thanks, Carson. No problem. <laughs> Hello, Tiger. We need to get you back to your owner. She's a friend of mine, you know. <laughs> this is Mrs Higgly Piggly's house. Grandma phones Mrs Higgly Piggly and tells her that Tiger Fluffy Boots had to be rescued from a tree. And then we take him home. Hello, Hello. Mrs Higgly Piggly. Here he is. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for bringing Tiger oh. Fluffy Boots back home. <laughs> Why did you go so far up the tree, Tiger? That was my Mossy the dog's fault, wasn't it, Topsy and Tim? <laughs> yes. Mossy barked at you, didn't oh, she? Oh, dear. Oh, Tiger. But we stopped Mossy barking, and then the fire brigade came to rescue Tiger. Mm -hmm. Oh, did. It was so exciting. Oh, you should have seen what it happened. Must have been. It was, wasn't it? Yes. And that's when Grandma said, I think it's time to go home for tea now. I think it's time to go home for tea now, Topsy <laughs> and Tim. You ready to say goodbye? Bye bye, Mrs. Higgly Piggly. <laughs> See you soon, Tiger Fluffy Boots. Oh, yes. Bye bye, Jean. And goodbye, Topsy and Tim. <laughs> bye. Bye. Come on. Mossy will be waiting for us at home. And that's it, Grandma. Was that? Doggy biscuits, yeah. too. Which doggy biscuits would you like to eat? Hello. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Today, Tiger Fluffy Boots was stuck up a tree. Can you remember what Dad borrowed from Mr Fenn to try and rescue Tiger Fluffy Boots? Was it a ladder? Or was it some rope? The answer is behind Wiggles the Rabbit. Look, the answer is a ladder. Watch this. Come on, Fuss. Come on. Come on, come on. Tiger. Come on. Come on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nearly, Dad. Nearly. You can do it, Dad. Great game. Good fun. See you soon.
more room for running about down there. No, thank you, Mummy. We're playing indoors today. OK, well, look, can you just calm down a little bit? Lunch is nearly ready. I've got tomato soup and ham sandwiches. Oh, yum, yum! My favourite! <laughs> what should we play next? I know. You hide, and when the person looking for you gets near you... Boo that! Boo! <laughs> <laughs> yes, hide and boo. You both hide, and I'll count, OK? Oh! Come on, Tony! Oh. Go, go, go! in everybody. I've made you some cheese and ham sandwiches just for you Tony because I know that they're your favourite. Thanks Mr. Oh, you're welcome. You're all very quiet. Everything alright with you Tim? Yummy. Are you okay? Maybe you should play something a little bit calmer this afternoon. How about some drawing? Mm-hmm. Thanks for lunch, Mummy. Please, can we go and do some making upstairs? Of course you can. We're all glad when lunchtime is over. Come on. Thanks for lunch, Mrs O'Dell. Sorry, we were I'm very hungry, Mummy. That's OK. You can show me your pictures when you finish them later. Now it's time to mend Mummy's vase. We tried to stick the broken piece back on the vase with glue from my make and do box. No. But it's hard to do it. I'm going to try clay now. Yet. Oh yes! I'll do the cutting and I'll hold this. Okay, you you do that and I'll put the big piece in. The big piece first. So where does it go? Another piece. And look, let's put this round here. Yes! We're nearly done! So I need three, two, one done! Yes! It looks all messy. Um, <laughs> Mummy's going to see the tape. Oh, Mummy's going to be really sad. I know. We can colour it in. Yes. Juice. Quick, 
Mommy's coming. Mm. What, you'd all like a drink? Um. Thank you, Mommy. Oh, what are you making? Yet, Mrs. O'Dell. No, we haven't. Okay. Well, you all look very busy. <laughs> okay. You should tell Mummy now. I know. About the vase. I know. Mm. We've mended it though. Let's just put it back on the whole table. We carry the vase back downstairs and into the hall. Hello, gang. Hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Hello, Mr. Rodan. Where's my big hello, Dad? <laughs> now, where's Mummy? I bought these for her. Hello. Oh. I bought you these to say happy wedding anniversary, George. Oh. Mwah. Thank you, Brian. They're gorgeous. <laughs> Is it your wedding anniversary? Today? Yeah. We've been married for six whole years. Thank you, Brian. I'll put them in a vase. Oh, that's odd. Where's my vase gone? Um, we broke it, Mummy. We're sorry. We're really sorry, Mummy. We should have told you. We tried to mend it. Look. You're right. You should have told me straight away, and then we could have all fixed it together. Not like this. Sorry, Mummy. Sorry, Mummy. Oh, Sorry. Oh, Sorry, Mrs. Oh, O'Day. That's OK. Do you know what? Accidents happen. OK? <sighs> I bet no one else has a vase quite like this. Oh! <laughs> 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 Tony went home and Mummy mended the vase properly with some special grown-ups glue. And then Mummy and Dad got all dressed up. The flowers look lovely there. Oh, you look so pretty, Mummy! Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> because it's our anniversary, twins, Mummy and I are going to go out for a treat. And you two are going to get a treat too. <gasps> yes! And that's when Mummy said, Danielle, the babysitter, is coming to play with you this afternoon. Danielle, the babysitter, is going to come and play with you both this afternoon. Yay! Danielle the babysitter. We yes. love her. <laughs> so please try and be good and no more breakages. We promise. We promise. Now, how about an anniversary? Oh. Oh. <laughs> and that said Dad was that. Good at remembering. Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> today was Mummy and Dad's wedding anniversary. Can you remember what present Dad brought home for Mummy? Was it a bunch of flowers? Or was it a box of chocolates? The answer is behind the jigsaw piece. Look, the answer is a bunch of flowers. Watch this. Where's my big hello, Dad? <laughs> now, where's Mummy? I bought these for her. Hello. Oh. I bought you these to say happy wedding anniversary, George. Oh, thank you, Brian. They're gorgeous. Great game. That was good fun. See you soon.